So my controller just came in for my electric lawnmower I'm making. It is an Alltrax NPX4834 controller. Just came in today. Let me give you a little size comparison of it. Right there next to a soda can. For all you who are not familiar with the, what the controller does, the controller will control, like the name implies, will control the uh, power from the batteries and send it to the uh, motor. So I can vary my speed of my mower, which allows me to go faster or slower. This is a non-programmable one, so, but it is rated at 48 volts for me and uses a 0 to 5k potentiometer. Basically, there's all your connections. This is a used motor. I got it for about $170 off eBay. Where these motors new will go for about, I know the programmable one goes for about 300 and up. So you can tell it is used by the wear on it, but it's nothing major. And it, it does work. And this is where you would connect the uh, batteries to it. And the motor. And here's all your connectors for your uh, potentiometer, your key, and your LED right here is your status LED. And it is made in the USA, so it says on the back it's probably made in the USA. But I got something else made in the USA. And it does come with a fuse, a little heavy, big old fuse right there. And then just basically that's all you'll do. I don't know if it goes on that one or not, but that's what, basically that's all I have to do. And good thing they included a manual for me. It tells me about the warranty and a wiring diagram. Here's your uh, little bit of manual for you. For stock vehicles only. Yep. <laughs> I'm not making a golf cart, so it will have to do. Here are good things about all tracks. And here's uh, um all tracks controllers like this one have been used on motorcycle conversions and what have you. So it's what I'll be using. This is a little simple wire diagram. It tells you about the models of different controllers. Important information, wire diagram, you have to put the fuse and all that. And I did get it at EV Drive, they're at eBay. So, it shipped fast, got here good, wrapped up nice and neat. Like I said, there is some wear marks on it, but of course it is a used product. But it says it's been through uh, testing at Alltrax's facility, you know. You know, it seems fine to me. And this is what I'll be using. I'm place to mount it. And this, it, it feels kind of heavy, but probably just from the metal casing. Really don't know what that is. And they said it is watertight. I'm not, I'm not pretty sure it's not waterproof, but it's watertight. And that's about it. And I believe this is where they will. It's not. It's not programmable by the user like me, but it's programmable by a uh, all tracks facility. It might be where they program it at, but I'm not sure. And at the top, and there's that and what these little prongs that stick out and what they do.